How about you? I'm Hank. Today we got a really cool video. I'm going to take Brutus, our Branson 5220. We're going to load it up on the RAM, and then we're going to take some of our Homestead implements, specifically, specifically, man, that's a hard word to say, the grapple and the landscape rake, and we're going to do some off-site work. But this off-site work's a little different, right? I'm actually doing it for free. You know, why would you be doing free off-site work? I'll tell you about it in just a second. So this is actually our first video with the Homestead Implements Grapple, right? This one's 320 pounds, 79 inches, and it's uh, the Pinnacle series, which is their heavy-duty series. I've got discount codes in the description, but let me tell you about it. If you, They always offer free shipping in the continental U.S., homesteadimplements.com. You can also get 5% off using the code HANK5. Again, it's in the description. And if you're a veteran, you can get 10% off with US Vet 10. Let's hook this thing up, let's get the landscape break on, and let's get to our project. What I do for my quick hitch, see how I put that letter A there and the letter A here? That matches that top link here. Now I just gotta remove this kickstand again. This is the Pinnacle series. I'll take this kickstand, move it up, and we'll be good to go with the landscape rake. This landscape rake is adjustable. So you pull this pin out and you can do it so you can make windrows and stuff like that. All right, let's get her loaded up onto the trailer. So I got Brutus loaded up, right, the Branson. So now let me tell you why I'm doing this off-site work for free. See that little white house right there? That's our guest house. And our kids have been living there. My daughter, her husband, and our grandchildren. And they're building a new place to stay. And so at their new home, they need some root raking done. So me, being the great father-in-law that I am, want to get them out of the house quickly. I mean, I want to get them moved into their new house quickly. <laughs> So we're going to go over there and help them there. You know, I'm so proud of them But we're gonna go over there and help them do some root raking and we're gonna see how this homestead implements grapple does Along with the landscape rake on the back of it. We get down the road though. I do want to mention look at that 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 2500 don't squat at all when I'm saying pretty impressive. So we made it This is the new construction site over there, but I'll show you more about it here in a sec Now let's get this thing unstrapped off the trailer and get to work One down, one to go. So what I like to do before I start any project is walk the area first. And we don't have that much to do. It's probably less than an acre. Actually, probably probably half acre. But someone has come out and they bush hogged hit the property behind him. And so it makes it pretty easy for me. I'm just going to go up to the bush hog line. We're going to take out that tree and take out that clump of trees and put the debris right here in, to the right of that old dead scrap tree there so that's what we're going to be doing today pretty simple but i'm going to walk it to make sure that nothing surprises me there is going to be some stumps 
Uh, looks like there might be a little stunt like this right here. That might get me. I'll, I'll be all right, I think. It ain't nothing that's going to tear my tractor up, which is the important part. And we'll get it pushed over to that kind of barren area over there. I think the first thing we're going to do is push over that tree. He says it's kind of wet out here, so we'll see. Let's get a little bump on it here and see what, see what we're working with here. Okay. <laughs> that thing split right there, you see that? There it goes. Alright. Well, that's not exactly what I planned, but sure. chunk of it there. There you go. Yeah, we'll keep making little passes like this and, and getting that whole pile of brush taken away. Well, there's the tractor. <laughs> Hank, what's the tractor doing over here? That's a great question. I'm glad you asked. See all this debris and stuff? Well, the cool thing about all this debris is it rips up your hydraulic lines underneath the tractor so I'm gonna put that down I'm gonna get up underneath it and replace the hydraulic hose luckily nothing broke I just have to the hoses came off and I got to replace the hose clamp and the you know the the four hundred dollars worth of hydraulic fluid okay we are back in business I'm gonna go up here we put five gallons of hydraulic fluid in it so I'm gonna go now top all get it filled up and I'm gonna go back to work but hey I got to get lunch in the I got to get lunch during the little maintenance break now, so that's good. All right, I've got this left to do. I'm gonna stay away from this area. Don't like losing hydraulic fluid over there. <laughs> if you can see, I don't know if it comes across in the camera or not, but look how dark it is right there compared to how light it is here. Well, this is dry and that starts to get muddy and sappy. Probably not gonna be able to get that corner right there because I'm a, I don't wanna get stuck, but this is what we've done so far. And this is what we got left to do. So it shouldn't take us too much longer. This side is a lot easier than that other side. I had to, a lot of stumps and a lot of mud to go through over there. So let's keep working. aerial view of what it looks like after I've done that. Sorry I didn't get a before aerial view, but I couldn't get the drone to connect. Let's check out the after view.
right, Brutus did good. The homestead influence. Look, I don't even think. Ah, I scratched my. Is that scratch or dirt? Ah, I scratched my sticker. You believe that? <laughs> Pinnacle homestead implement grapple did great, as well as the landscape rate. I'm not going to be able to get this stuff right here. This is wetlands type stuff. And again, I, like I was showing you earlier, the dark spots where it's nice and muddy. So I'm just going to leave that alone because I don't feel like getting stuck. Anyway, th so this again, this is my first off site job experience. <laughs> so luckily, it's my son in law. He didn't have to pay me anything, but he did buy lunch, so that was pretty cool of him. You can save 5% using the code HANK5 on homesteadimplements.com, or if you're a U.S. veteran, you can save 10% U.S. Vet 10 on Homestead Implements, and also free shipping always. Okay, you guys take care. Click on this white circle. Click on this video right here. God bless.